I'm Matt Berkowitz, and I am the AOF. I'm Matt Berkowitz. I was the post-production supervisor on The Will of Victory, a doc opera. A doc opera? Yeah. Explain this to me. What is this film? We wanted to deconstruct the idea of a documentary and use the structure of an opera to tell the story. And what's the, what's the story about? It's about World War II, about how the Russians joined together to defeat the common threat, the Nazis. Somebody mentioned this film that it was all found footage. Yeah. Explain that to me. Well, one of the producers had, it was their pet project, they had been wanting to put this together for a couple years. They brought it to Robert Ferretti, the director, and said, we've got ho over a hundred hours of never before seen Russian and German footage from World War II. And they colorized and done two case scans and they brought it to us and we put together a Nice, pretty good documentary. Paint the picture for me. This is a 45 minute piece? 45 minute film, yes. And uh, what's the music? It's all original Russian and German music from the time period. And when we put it together, <clears throat> we slated all the music across the film, and then we brought in a composer to fill in the rest. And as the director, Robert Ferretti, says, that the music is supposed to be the dialogue of the film. Mm. Just like in any opera, when you walk in, sit down, you don't know what they're saying, but you know the title cards and you get the general tone of the film, or the opera, rather. And what is this footage like? Oh, it's everything. It's action, it's love, it's people leaving, it's people coming home, it's people crying, it's great. Oh, so it's just anything in that period, found footage, who shot the footage? Where did the footage come from? Everybody. Well, actually, during that time, the Russian and German military were documenting the, their, their war for their own propaganda purposes. So a lot of film from that time period had been lost, put in museums, put in different docu you know, different places, and never before put into a real documentary. Why should people come to see your film? Well, it's a contemporary documentary. We wanted to make it for today's youth. That's part of the reason why it's colorized and so stylized, is we thought that it was something that should, especially the general tone of the film, of the country uniting to defeat something, was something that still applied today. So we thought it was still significant to what is going on currently in the world. Mm -hmm.